Hey, dear medicos, we are having the honor to have Dr. Tushar with us, rank 56 in INICT examination. So, better first of all, on the behalf of Dems family, I congrats you for this achievement. Thank you, sir. So, how you are feeling with after getting this rank? Was uh, was you are expecting this rank? Yeah, in top hundred. Sir, sir, honestly speaking, I was not expecting this good a rank. I wanted somewhere less than 500, but this rank is pretty good for me. I was very happy. Well, My parents were also ecstatic. That's great. Yeah, great rank. Double digit rank in the Central Institute. And I will be using this platform. But let us use next couple of minutes for making some planning, some strategy for the juniors. All the medicals. Yes, sir, so if I ask you, okay, in this rank of 56, what is the key point? Like I say, out of 10 points which were responsible for your success, what is the most important thing in preparation? I'm talking about preparation. So number one, I would definitely say multiple revisions. M my approach was reading fast and multiple revisions because I remember Sumer sir once told in class that multiple revisions will help over slow reading. That was applicable for me. Many people prefer maybe slow reading. That helps them, but not for me, sir. So multiple revision, but I, I like, I, I will proudly share here on this platform. Can you join our Dan's Kolkata batch as a foundation third year? So Bida, yes, what, how it was possible? Like I will be asking you how many times you revise the notes before going for the examination? Sir, my plan was to get my concepts clear while doing the classes. So many factual information is there that I knew that I couldn't retain while doing the classes. During internship, I couldn't manage my studies, so I didn't give in a lot of effort during internship. After internship, I pushed myself to revise these facts, keep reading the notes again and again, like at least two to three times. And along with that, I used to solve MCQs. Just by reading also, you cannot remember so many things and just by solving you cannot grasp them both of them together it gives a better result and beta you're saying like you revised two to three times so how it was possible like you made your class notes in third year your yes, own self-written notes how you concise the notes can you share the strategy on this platform sir notes were there i used to read it from there like first time i read it then i used to solve mcqs Few MCQs were definitely out of the notes. So if the MCQs were like, it seemed like very important topic, I used to add them to the notes. And if it was like something, like something statistical question, I used to leave them. I knew it's not possible for me to retain them anyway. So no point adding them. These questions are just there. Maybe in the exam, so it will come. These are like bouncer questions. You have to leave them. So whether you you like you completed whole survey, like I take my ENT, you complete the whole ENT in three days. What was the role of that discipline learning in your success of 56? Sir, if you like do the do the one subject at a time, then you like get a hold of whatever you have read. Then the second revision after equally spaced revisions, if you're doing like I did one subject in the month of June. Then the same subject, if I'm revising in the month of maybe August, then I'm giving it adequate time to settle it in my brain. Then I'm again opening the topic and seeing it again. So if, but if I do it very, like within very less time, if I did first in June, then again, I did after 15 days, but I'm not getting time to do other subjects. Short subjects, I know like ENT is there, ophthalmology is there, psychiatry is there, dermatology is there. Four to five questions will come but the subject in itself is not very small i have to put in so much efforts so my point was to know all the basics i cannot afford to get it wrong along with that in any set previous years questions are very important you have to do them because they will repeat the question more than 50 percent will be the repeat of the same topic same so topic. my plan was to at least read those topics carefully Paper was, like if I ask you, paper was tough or was moderate or it was very easy for you. What was your experience with that? So my experience was, I knew the topics, whatever was asked, but options were definitely confusing. So such close options are not easy to rule out. Even if I study like four to five times, still it is tough. Agreed. Some Agreed. questions I have to take a guesswork. 
let's rest is left to like god let's see what happens how many mcqs you attempted how many sir MCQs? i attempted roughly 185 to 186 186 were that you were not aggressive like completing all the mcqs complete uh, not leaving a single question you attempt you restrict yourself around 185 yes sir i left 10 questions definitely i marked them i won't do them La- five questions i did not mark i thought i will see but three to four minutes were left i marked one or two so what do you feel now you must have checked all the answer keys what was your gut feeling at that night those were right answer which you left or no So the ones which I left, I did not remember the questions. The questions were so in depth. No, no. So I did I not know those topics only. Coming on the time management, what was the role of time management in your success? <clears throat> Sir, when I gave the initiate in my first attempt, I understood that questions are pretty long. There is only one eighty minutes and two hundred questions are there. So, sir, my approach was to see all the two hundred questions within two hours to two hours ten minutes. in this approach i could make sure that i have seen all the 200 questions i wouldn't miss out any easy questions which were at the fag end of the exam then in within the 2 hours i had seen all the 200 questions i would have solved minimum 140 to 150 questions remaining one hour i would go back and check those remaining 50 to 60 questions which i had left which i was confused about in that time period i would solve like 40 to 50 questions and i knew i would have to leave 10 questions to 12 questions so sir i have been following that approach since the first attempt and then all the grand tests i gave in that approach only and what was your rank when you appeared for the first time but last to last when you appeared sir my rank that time was around 9000 something 9200 So the nine thousand to rank double digit fifty six. What was what what change you made after appearing for the first attempt? What you realize, K? I should do these things extra so that I can improve my rank. And you improve to rank fifty six because your words will be big motivation for all these students who are expecting good rank, but they got somewhere around nine ten thousand. So what was the change you made, sir? My first year and second year subjects were a bit lacking biochemistry. anatomy microbiology pharmacology i realized many questions are coming from these topics and these form the key for all these competitive exams so i <coughs> i had to make sure that i do these topics thoroughly because many questions will come it will keep repeating so you concentrate more focus more on the basic science which i am getting from your words yes sir definitely and what was your strategy in the like third year final year when you were writing notes what was the importance of those notes in your prof examination sir in the prof examinations we had to write long answer questions so while doing these dams classes i realized the importance of understanding the basic concepts the basic essence of the topic i could grasp that and i could like build on it even if any question is asked i could right answers from those concepts maybe i don't know all the facts and that is not possible to know all the facts anyway and coming on the next segment like beta after writing your own notes what i'm getting from your message k concise notes self written notes play the important role your internship and you join our tnd course comparing the mcq level like i'm taking the first question bank that is your gt's swt followed by i will be talking about tnd how you managed to attempt the mcq <laughs> GT is an SWT, and what was the level of GT if you compare with INSCT? So, uh, dams GTs were like framed like just the initiate initiate exams we used to give, sir. And these questions were definitely the pattern and all was very similar to whatever we used to follow, uh, sir. So, Uh, basically these pattern of questions like we used to give i would definitely say that while giving while giving these tests i followed the time pattern then solved these questions and then came back to review it so talking of tnd those questions were definitely very very helpful i did your class sir it was like those crisp notes which i made those very high yield points those table forms they were like very good definitely i would recommend everyone to do it do 
take up dams tnd course without giving it a second thought because like these 6 hour sessions that dams is conducting you can do one subject at one go i will interrupt in between i think i, I think uncle your father is there yes, yes sir convey my regards to him and convey my wishes to him because this what i feel that this rank 56 is your parents rank yeah what this sir definitely is... sir definitely my both my parents are doctors sir right. both of them are gynecologists that great convey my regard to him okay so yes sir तो नाउ बेटा कमिंग ऑन द लाइक क्वालिटी ऑफ एमसीक्यूज लेवल ऑफ एमसीक्यूज जीटीज एंड एसडब्ल्यूटी व्हाट यू फील व्हाट यू फील के जीटीज एंड एमसी एसडब्ल्यूटी लेवल ऑफ एमसीक्यूज क्वालिटी ऑफ एमसीक्यूज इफ यू कंपेयर विद योर आईएनएससीटी एग्जामिनेशन सो जीटीज आर डेफिनेटली प्लेस्ड वन लेवल अहेड ऑफ आईएनएससीटी एंड दैट इज रिक्वायर्ड ऑब्वियसली यू नीड टू लो नो वन लेवल अबव द एग्जाम्स एंड but more important was sir in my point of view the patterns which the dams followed i gave the dams mock on 4th of november and i could say after giving the initiate that many of the patterns were repeated so i had a hold of that topics also were repeated level was almost same as i said ki gts are definitely one level tough and you have to keep solving it's more about the practice and coming to the dvt segment beta you attended our dvt segment what was the role of that dvt in your success story so dvts were like sir, super fast revisions two hour sessions you get a ho- hold of all the small uh, small little important things in the topic you have like dams has extracted all the important points from all the important books and they are deli- delivering it to us i you can read question. reference will... books but it's not possible to remember so much you have you are all experts in the field you have read the important topics and then you are delivering to us i will convey your feedback to all the faculties and these compliment beta these are the driving force for all of us and so definitely sir coming on the like mcqs like we are discussing mcqs after every dvt session in the evening rapid fire round the, what was the role of those mcqs pattern and level of mcqs coming in the center institute so i could not get your question after dvt after like fast revision we used to conduct our mcqs in the evening after dvt session what yes, was sir. the use of those mcqs beta so those mcqs were also like pre- pre- many of them were previous years questions and many of them were curated by teachers of the institute sir so these questions were also like they were framed with something in mind that some of these may come sir while doing them you could get a hold of it like yes this topic is important so while revising i'll put a star mark over it definitely read them again second revision time i'll read them again third time i will read this again or i j- just write these points in the first page of my notebook while revising so like i can say any pediatric scoring system surgical scoring system medicine scoring system i have to put a star mark definitely these are important i cannot afford to forget this for example surgery gcs is definitely important everyone has to know a question on gcs comes you cannot answer you are losing out on your ranks you are losing out at least 50 ranks or 100 ranks that's very true but you are just sharing the basic points which every medico should keep in mind when he is preparing for the central institute now coming like you are getting rank 56 i am very proud to share dr tushar from dams kolkata with us yes, rank 56 so beta i just want you must have taken the best advantage of our or live platform of you medico how you can suggest your medicos what is the best way to extract best thing from e medicos and what was the role of live lectures of e medicos sir my live i first did live lectures during the 2022 uh, 2020 lockdown period so mm-hmm. live lectures I, i i would say you should go for live lectures because it will it will inculcate a sense of discipline if you are at home recordings also you can watch but recordings you can watch at your own free time but while watching live videos you are seeing the efforts of the teachers you are seeing other students also trying to study that would inculcate a sense of discipline by sitting down for 6 hours that would inculcate a sense of this increasing your sitting hours because while studying for the exams you have to put in those extra hours extra efforts without that it's difficult 
all these competitive exams because everyone is studying everyone is good no one is uh, not putting efforts i would say so you have to do it uh, you are using the word discipline and you followed our discipline strict religiously and you attended all the lecture 3 hour 6 hour yes. session now what do you feel like after getting rank 56 because at that time when everybody was saying everybody was in comfort when during the covid period now what you realize kid that discipline lecture was the game changer so definitely i would say for me putting in all those efforts definitely paid off so i would say you can go you should go for it any any mem any any moment you remember for that the 2020 lockdown because it was very difficult era for everyone for the students for the faculties and how all the dams faculty came on e medicals with a live lecture so beta wo wo time jab hum log sham ko live lecture karte the any special moment you remember sir i remember before the lockdown period just before this lockdown period sumesh sir had conducted a class in dams kolkata batch just after that <laughs> after like two days log complete lockdown happened it was all of a sudden we, were, we had done like more than 10 batches of class in a period of two months it was so hectic doing classes in college then coming and doing this just after that all of a sudden lockdown happened it was so much of uncertainty no college for such a long time then these live classes came up we had something to do at least like some motivation for us to study Overall, all these fun sessions we used to have in dams, that was some bit of energy booster for us. And coming on the CBT, Peter, like at last time we were asking your experience with the CBT, when you appeared and that experience of CBT, how that played the role? So CBT, I would say, sitting in the classroom and then giving the exam on a computer, definitely getting a feel of the real exam and then solving it in front of the computer otherwise i i would also say that i was a bit lazy while solving mcqs i used to solve on my mobile phone lying down in the bed that gave a real feel to the exam and then mcq solving within those three hours period that is also very important you have to get used to it okay. now coming on the last segment but i ask you three things any three things which made this rank of five six First of all, revision, revision, and revision. Second would be MCQ solving, and third would be giving grand tests regularly and then reviewing them. These three things I would say is the most important. You have to do it. Without, if any one of them is lacking, it will be very tough to get through this exam, through this pattern of exam. Because this requires you to do that. Any subject out of 19, which I say that any students who are getting now a rank of in a bracket of 10, 20,000 and they are preparing for the next central institute examination, which subjects do you feel they should give more preference? So I would still say they sh anyone and everyone should give first and second year subjects the most preference because that forms the crux, crux of our medical studies. Without that, I remember Siddharth Shekhar sir had told that you have to put in efforts to do the first two year subjects otherwise it will be difficult to get through this exam very true very true but absolutely at the last bit we wish you very best of luck and we are confident in the upcoming years you will definitely you will excel and you will do your best any special message for dams faculties sir i am extremely grateful to all of you sir for putting in so much efforts Putting, putting videos on YouTube, Instagrams, Facebooks regularly, putting up so many MCQs for us, giving us all these high yield extracts, like forever in debt to you. Thank so you, many of us are becoming doctors. Thanks. Sir. Everyone is grateful. Thank you. Sir. Best wishes. Priceless, sir. Thank you. The kind words and we wish you again best of luck. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir.